Hey everybody, it's Jason, and this is my wonderful adventure some beer. How's everybody doing today? Welcome back for joining me again. If you're here the first time, welcome aboard. But either way, don't forget, subscribe, like, and leave a comment. Love some feedback, guys. You can also send me emails. Please check out the website, too. So, you're probably wondering, why am I posting a video on a Tuesday? Well, if you've been following the channel, you know I'm a Georgia boy. And today is the first game of the World Series, and lo and behold, the Braves are in the World Series. Now, I'm not a sports guy. I honestly could care less. But being a Georgia guy, I gotta support them. Go sports! Eh, it's all good. Uh, but what better way to celebrate the Braves against the Astros tonight than having a beer? And what better way to support the Braves than having a local beer? That's right, I'm going to be drinking a beer from Terrapin Brewing Company out of Athens, Georgia. Uh, now Terrapin's getting some feed, uh, and they sold out to Coors Miller. They're still making some good beers though, and I like them, and, and I understand why, why they did what they did, but as long as they make good beer, I'll support them. Uh, so today's beer, like I said, is from Terrapin Brewing Company out of Athens, Georgia, and it is the Los Bravos. Yes, I picked that for a reason, y'all. Uh, the Los Bravos is an American lager. And what better way to celebrate the American sport of baseball than with an American lager? So here's our, our can art. It's a pretty cool can. I like it quite a bit. I love the Mexican skull on it, even though it's an American lager. <clears throat> kind of ironic. And uh, this does clock in at 5.1% ABV with 25 IBU. So it should be very sessionable, easy drinking beer. Now, Here's my predicament. I don't like drinking from a can. I really don't. But when you go to the game, you drink from a can. So I found the happy medium. Got the can glass we'll be using today. I'm not a big fan of these, but it's funny. So we're gonna do it. So let's go ahead and crack this open and uh, let's see what it's all about, folks. It's pouring quite nice. Looks like a traditional lager right off the bat. Nice and crisp and clean. Uh, it's got a nice good head on that, good inch thick. A good amount of bubbles coming up. Overall, it's a very beautiful looking beer. It looks like what an American lager should look like. Uh, so yeah, pretty good looking. I'm, I'm happy with it. On the aroma, I'm actually getting a little bit of citrus, not much, just a hint of it. And that would be coming from the, the hops that they put in there. I'm getting the breadiness of the lager. And it's just, it smells quite refreshing. So uh, let's quit wasting time, y'all, and let's put it down, y'all. That's pretty good. It tastes like a good old fashioned lager. It's a little bit bready, very clean, very crisp. I know people hate those words. It's like, well, what is clean and crisp? Uh, Clean and crisp as it goes down smooth. It doesn't leave any aftertaste on your palate. That would be uh, the clean. Crisp is it's just, it's not smooth, but it's, it goes down light. It's refreshing. So that's what I call crisp. But no, it's really good. I'm, I'm, I'm getting the, the grains and the barleys in there. And it's um, just a good drinking beer. I uh, highly recommend it. So uh, go Braves. Sorry, I don't have any... Uh, Braves attire, I'm not a sports guy, I'm a nerd. If Star Wars, I'd be all over it and have some Star Wars stuff. But uh, but no, I wish the best of the Braves tonight. And uh, let's go Georgia. Peace. Cheers, y'all. Have a beer.